How do you create something from nothing? You don't add, you subtract. This is Tsimtsum, the most counterintuitive concept in all of creation science. Before the beginning, there was only Ein Sof, infinite consciousness, not a being, not a location, pure energy vibrating at infinite speed, filling all space, perceived as total darkness because infinite frequency appears as void to bounded consciousness, to our ability to perceive wavelengths anyways. To create a universe, God had to do something radical. He had to constrict himself. Tsimtsum means constriction. God compressed a portion of his infinite energy to carve out a hollow, a bounded region within the infinite field where confined energy could exist. This is why the Sefer Yetzirah uses the verb engraved, not wrote. You engrave by removing material. You carve by hollowing out space. This act separated light from darkness. Darkness isn't empty. Darkness is energy at rest, the absolute, the zero-point field, the virtual quantum state. It's infinite, non-local, unconfined energy existing in a state of all potentiality. Light is energy in motion, confined, bounded, oscillating within the carved-out space. That's our universe. The holographic torus. Matter and space-time. Our reality is engraved into the body of God. We are confined energy within the infinite field a finite process running inside infinite RAM. And just like a program can't perceive the hardware it's running on, bounded consciousness can't directly perceive the absolute. We can only perceive its effects. Full breakdown of Tsimtsum, the physics of constriction, and why engraving is the most accurate verb for the start of what we know as creation. All in Connect to Source, available now on Amazon in all formats. Link in bio.